Animal diseases are rapidly spreading across the country. Egg, chicken, turkey, and beef shortages are getting worse every day. A fresh bird flu outbreak that is destroying millions of commercial flocks poses a threat to the nation's food supply systems and might drive up prices to an unanticipated heights. Welcome to 360 Economist. There's a lot to cover in today's video, so please don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe. A current bird flu outbreak has been sweeping the country in just a month of February. Already, millions of creatures have perished as a result. Since this was only the first month of the outbreak, experts say it is impossible to predict how severe it will ultimately be. The situation has been especially concerning in Iowa and Missouri, where nearly 2.8 million birds have died in the past month from a highly pathogenic avian influenza strain, and this outbreak is that it's rapidly hitting commercial flocks. Authorities have found cases of avian flu in a commercial flock of more than 50,000 turkeys in northwest Iowa. According to local sources, the virus has recently infected a farm in southeast Missouri with over 240,000 broiler chickens, a commercial mixed species flock in southeast South Dakota, and an egg-laying hen business in northeast Maryland. To stop the sickness from spreading further, every chicken had to be depopulated and killed. Authorities are urging farmers and growers not to sell animals infected by the pathogen, according to officials with the Delmarva Chicken Association. This is the first time since 2004 that avian influenza has been identified in broiler farms. They said that all affected frogs are being isolated and ensure that infected birds will not be distributed to the food system. Right now, the Consumer Price Index, which measures the average change in prices paid for things like food, for clothes, for housing, and for transportation, is up by 7.5%. The national average price for eggs rose by 13.1% last month, while chicken went up by 12.5%. Egg prices rose by 61%, chicken prices rose by 41%, and skinless turkey breast prices rose by 75%. In the upcoming months, consumers will experience some significant price increases as a result of the sickness. The hardest hit are farmers who are losing thousands of their raised and nourished livestock. Meat supplies are also becoming more scarce everywhere due to supply issues, and prices are continuing to rise. For those with the means, eating meat has become a privilege and luxury. Grain exports, particularly of wheat and corn, are falling sharply as the conflict between Russia and Ukraine worsens. As concern over the world's food supply grows, Many other nations are prohibiting exports or putting limits on the amount that can be shipped outside. Indonesia tightened export restrictions on palm oil last week, while other Eastern European countries also chose to prioritize domestic supplies over exports. Serbia also banned exports of wheat, corn, flour, and cooking oil to counter price increases. Last week, Hungary stopped all grain exports, while Bulgaria has said it will expand its grain inventories and may impose export restrictions until it has completed planned purchases. An emergency order prohibiting the export of grains and other items namely wheat, oats, millet, buckwheat, sugar, live cattle meat, and other products considered vital to the global economy was recently issued by Ukraine, renowned as the breadbasket of Europe, according to a new analysis by Zero Hedge. Roman Lechenko, Ukraine's Minister of Agrarian and Food Policy, said that prompt action was taken to prevent a humanitarian crisis, stabilize the market, 
and meet the population's needs for essential food supplies. One of the world's largest fertilizer producers, Russia, has chosen to stop exporting fertilizer, which is already wreaking havoc for farmers across the United States. Ben Rainshire, the owner of Blue Diamond Farming Company in Iowa, cautioned that the sanctions will have a significant influence on our food supplies in the very near future. In an interview with the Western Journal, Rancher remarked, If you're concerned about gas costs going up a dollar or two a gallon, wait till your grocery bill goes up $1,000 a month. Soaring fertilizer expenses are likely to bring rising food prices. We recently published a comment from an expert in agriculture who asserted that this year's crop planting in the United States is being avoided by many farmers due to the country's quadrupled fertilizer prices. Now that the battle has reached this degree, Goldman Sachs is issuing a warning that it might also set off a catastrophic energy catastrophe. The conflict was already generating supply chain imbalances in the food business. According to the Monday night study from the Goldman Sachs, given Russia's key role in the world's energy supply, the global economy may soon be confronted with one of the greatest energy supply shocks ever. In a research published yesterday, Reichstag Energy warned that if other Western countries follow America's lead and forbid the import of Russian oil, Petroleum prices might soar and reach $240 a barrel this summer. The decision would leave the market with a 4.3 million barrel per day gap in supply that just cannot be filled in a timely manner by other sources of supply. Prices in Washington were $3.85 a week earlier, $4.17 on Friday, and $4.43 on Tuesday. A Fox News report revealed that thieves are really cutting holes in fuel tanks, so they may siphon off the gasoline inside as the price of gasoline rises. The media site posted pictures of a vehicle's recent mishap. According to the photos, a burglar drilled a hole in the gasoline tank and drained the entire tank of gas. According to AAA, a nationwide wave of gasoline theft is occurring as a result of extraordinarily high prices. The group advises car owners to maintain the security of their vehicles. Gasoline is a commodity that is becoming more and more valuable and expensive. Thus, thieves are seeking methods to profit from it. Conditions are changing at a pace that is staggering, and world events have really begun to spiral out of control. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to share this message with friends and family. Share the link now, please, and turn the bell on to always keep updated with our latest notifications.